fam it's your boy Luke and welcome back to the channel today I'm doing a couple extra things right now um, my boy Andrew he's over there in the back today we have a little project we're gonna wrap my rearview mirror caps two-tone a different color on the top a different color on the bottom he does wraps on the side he's pretty good at it and um, it's uh, a good friend of mine's brother. Andrew, say what's up. <laughs> yeah, he's a man of few words. But anyway, you know, the work never stops on the Hawk. And today is actually, even though we're in quarantine, so to speak, uh, it's actually a nice day. A really, really nice day. It turned out to be like around 60 degrees today. So let's get this party started. All right, so first things, got to take these covers off. First, you got to take off the bottom piece. I have the mirror in the perfect position right here. There is a space right here. That's where you're gonna put the pry tool. I did it in prior videos before. You put the pry tool here, you take off the bottom first, then you pull the mirror forward, and with even pressure from the center of it, you take the top off. Here we go. All right guys, so obviously, from the previous wrap video for the stuff under the hood, my boy Andrew here, you see he's wiping down the surface to make sure everything is nice and clean because you definitely don't want any type of sediment. See how he's getting all between the grooves and the cracks in there. Definitely don't want any sediment because that'll be right under the vinyl. Now though, we're wrapping that big portion with this right here. This is a 5D, it's so beautiful and trippy. It's a 5D high gloss carbon fiber. I'll throw the link in the description. This is gonna look freaking dope. And then for the bottom portion for the bottom portion we're going to be doing a a green it's like a, a very light green which actually matches my mud flaps right here and my stickers that green it's a freaking 4d real trippy beautiful like like almost like holographic design 4d carbon fiber wrap it's beautiful bam so the top portion is finished. Take a look at the bottom. All the seams are nice and perfect. He did a really, really good job in the post heat. So the wrap really took to the edges. And let me tell you, man, this freaking pattern is so dope. It actually looks like lifelike. Such a great job. So now we're about to do the bottom and he's about to do his thing. All right, you guys know the deal. He's cleaning down the surfaces just like the last time. Once that's clean, he's going to start the wrap. So here we go. Alright, so we just finished this piece up, came out pretty dope, and the lines, the etching on the carbon fiber matches the top piece, which is also pretty dope. So now, all that's left, he has to just do the same thing on the other side, and I'll put these on the car in the meantime, make sure the fitment is proper. All right, we're losing some light, but this is the pieces on real quick. That's the bottom, top. Can't wait to take some shots for you during the daytime. This thing is beautiful. And best part about it, if you drop back, look at that green portion on the bottom and look at the flaps. Dope. 
See what I'm saying? That's what I'm talking about right there. So he's uh, heating up the material for the other side and we'll see y'all soon. All right guys, so what you missed is he finished the top driver's side portion. Yo, look at that freaking carbon fiber, so dope. Most people only do like that freaking 3D stuff. You gotta step out of that box, man. So now what he's doing is he's gonna line up the striations of the bottom piece. He's literally lining up to match the top, like how it's coming down on the slope. And he's about to put this shit on there. All right, guys, so you wouldn't believe this, but the you would think that the small piece, the small portion of this would be easier. No, it's not. This has a lot of different edges and stuff like that. So you really, really gotta be careful with how you lay the material and stuff like that. The larger piece is actually not bad. It's a smaller piece because there's a lot of definition. So keep that and take that into consideration. All right, guys, so finally the pieces are complete. Look at that green, son. Mud flat green, it's freaking dope. And this black is just freaking great. So let me just pop this back on real quick, show you the end result. Obviously guys, I'm in the garage, it's freaking black out there. So we gotta come in here. All right guys, as you saw from the time lapse, put the pieces back on. That green definitely adds a nice little tasteful hint to the greens around the car. I can't keep saying that enough. This black, oh by the way guys, see me wiping it? It definitely loves fingerprints, so beware. But that black looks so freaking lifelike, it feels like you can Feel the edges if you put your nail on it, but it's totally smooth. Beautiful, beautiful piece. We uh, we actually had fun doing this little project, Andrew and I. He did a really, really good job with this. See, see how the fingerprints are in there? It's just crazy. Give me a sec. Get that bad boy up. Beautiful. Beautiful. See how the fingerprints? Things love fingerprints. But anyway, I'll put his digits in the description. And as I said, I'll be taking some video uh, tomorrow for you guys. And definitely like, subscribe, comment, let me know what you think. Thank you for taking this ride with me once again. See you guys soon. Peace. All right, guys, so next day, the sun is out. It's kind of cold, though. Look at that. It's freaking beautiful. Beautiful. Love it. This freaking wrap, man. It's so lifelike. Loves fingerprints, though. And that coloration of the bottom piece definitely matches those flaps. Look how beautiful that shit looks. Let's go around. Don't mind the tape on the splitter. I had him up on ramps. I was doing some other videos underneath. Damn. That is beautiful. Wow. Damn, that's beautiful. Can't stop looking at it. Cannot stop looking at it. Alright guys, you know what to do. Like, subscribe, definitely drop a comment. And I'll see you guys soon.